there's more room for your crops and the equipment. If we talk about temperatures, there's better heat retention and ventilation. This tomato is falling down because of these clusters and clusters, clusters full of tomatoes. So it means this. Yes, like this, you see? I'm done. I'm done. Mm -hmm. Let's go. So guys, this is candela. Candela tomatoes thrive in controlled temperatures, guys. As you can see, the tomato, the tomato. Ah, <laughs> in a greenhouse. Oh, shake this thing. Ah, I have to fix this before going anywhere. Let's fix it together. Ah. My camera on the ground. Here. Let me see. Maybe I have to put this camera this side so I can fix this. Okay. Could you please help me hold the camera? I just want to fix this. Uh -huh, uh -huh, uh -huh. This is it. I have to do trellising like this to support the tomato so that it won't fall down. Hello everyone. Today I'm in a greenhouse, a place outside Darari, where we are diving into tomato farming, specifically a candela variety, known for its high yield, sweet flavor, large uh, fruit size, uniformity in color, and long shelf life. The farmer is using drip system to irrigate the crop. Here there are two greenhouses. One is uh, 1,200 square meters and the other one is 1,100 square meters. This variety is popular with farmers since it matures early, 80 to 90 days. One can cultivate candela on open field or in the greenhouse. As you can see, guys, this is a big greenhouse. As I told you guys, there are two greenhouses here. This one is the first one, and this one is 1,100 square meters. And today, the farmer is busy doing trellising and the pruning process of the crop. So people are busy in the greenhouse. They are doing a great job. That's trellising. That's how they do it. Like that. Mm -hmm. Yeah. There's a string here. Two strings, I'm sure. Moving upwards, upwards. And this, these strings separate here. That's where they are separating. The other one is moving up here, and the other one is moving up here. So that's double stemming, as you can see. Mm -hmm.
The tomatoes are beginning to ripen. So let's go and I'm gonna show you guys uh, the big greenhouse which is um, 1,200 square meters. Yes, this one from here. As you can see, so this is big, it's one thousand two hundred. Makadi, no, 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 no